welcome to the CFPA YouTube channel. Uh, this is the Spotlight Center where I'm going to be interviewing students, uh, teachers, and performers alike on different projects that are going around the studio and more, stuff like that. So, today's guest is CFPA student, teacher, and aspiring singer-songwriter Molly O'Keefe. Hey guys! <laughs> Molly's been a student at CFPA for the past three years, performing in medleys such as Finding Neverland as Sylvia and Pirate Queen as Grace. Welcome, Molly! Thanks for having me, Heather! Yeah, let's go! It's a talk show moment. Yes, exactly. <laughs> this is the CFPA talk show moment. <laughs> so, the music video for your original song, Julia, just premiered on the CFPA YouTube channel today as we're recording this. <laughs> Um, are you excited to have your work out in the world? I'm so excited. I think it's super cool. There's so many opportunities that come from CFPA that I just like never would have had before. And I think it's so awesome because it's it's one of those things that I've like wanted to make happen, but like I just don't have time mm -hmm. to like film a YouTube video, edit it all myself. So it's super cool to have a place for that to happen. Yeah, you have so many outlets here yeah. and like people that are a good support system Great. and helping yeah. things happen. So. <laughs> oh, I love that. Yeah, that's so good. So, correct me if I'm wrong, but I heard that you started writing this song in particular one day while you were on a trip. Is that true? Yes, so that's true. I was on summer vacation. I was in PI, actually. PI. Like, by the beach, by the ocean. <laughs> and I was like, oh, I have not written a song in so long. Like, what do I write about? So I just kind of started writing a story about this girl. And it just kind of went from there. Oh, like, what nice. kind of what kind of story can I write? Cool. Yeah. So like what inspired you? Was it just the it thought was, of writing a story? Yeah, or? it was kind of the environment I was in, like things that I was feeling, but also I felt like there was I just kind of wanted to create this girl who like wasn't me, mm -hmm. but I could oh, put yeah. in that place and like let her go through the journey <laughs> instead of me. I was yeah. tired of it. I was like, you can do it instead. <laughs> So, um, do you have any sort of musical inspirations that influence Julia or your songwriting in general? Um, Lizzie McAlpine is my Ooh. number one, like, oh my god, I want to say her kind of thing. <laughs> but, yeah, oh my god, I love her so much. Just, like, her lyrics and, like, the instruments she uses, everything about her music, I think, is so tasteful and, like, intentional, and that's how I want my music to be, is intentional. And, like, Ooh, I love that intentional. I love the like intent in yeah, the intense. song. Oh, uh -huh. That's such a good answer, Molly. <laughs> wow. So, um, how do you typically? I want to kind of like go through your writing process mm -hmm. a bit. So, how do you typically feel when you're writing your music? Um, I never force myself to sit down and write anything, which I think has really helped. Like recently, I don't write very often anymore, but I'll find myself coming up with something randomly and then sitting down on my guitar and like picking something out and then things just kind of happen and like when I let them, when I force things, nothing happens. Right. Yeah. So I like to think that like my music is definitely an outlet and I definitely reach towards songwriting when I need something to express mm -hmm. how I'm feeling. Um, and I think that it's just like a really healthy way. Yeah, yeah, for sure. And that applies to other things too, not for just sure. songwriting. Like, mm -hmm. I know when I'm trying to write like a book, mm -hmm. it's like you can't, the chapters no. don't just come out of nowhere. They have to come to you and yeah. then you and go then, to the computer. No, for sure. Yeah. Um, so what does music mean to you? Music for me has been a constant through like my whole life. Mm -hmm. And I think it's always something you can develop within yourself too. It's like something you can continuously learn about. There's never like an end point, which I think is super fun because it's like, okay, I know this now, what's next? And I always like having something next, like something, a new goal. Yeah, to something have. to look forward to. Yeah, exactly. All right, <laughs> one last question now before I let you go. <laughs> Who is Julia? <laughs> <laughs> this could be like a literal thing or a metaphorical thing. I know you kind of answered it already, but who is Julia? That's a good question. Julia is a girl who, I don't know. Julia is like me, but not me. Julia is like a girl who I was, or like who maybe I will be again in the future. Julia is, I feel like someone a lot of people can relate yeah. to. But like not someone specific at yeah. the same time. She's just that. kind of yeah. there. But she's oh, that's so cool. <laughs> Why that name? Why Julia? Did it just sound I like just it? that literally was just the name that came to me. The syllables worked. The <laughs> it off yeah. the tongue. Yeah. I was like, okay. <laughs> I love it. Oh, 
Alright, well thank you Molly for sitting down with me to chat about your me. music. <laughs> oh, it was so fun. Okay. Oh my gosh. And thank you all for tuning in. Yeah. Um, if you haven't checked out Molly's song, Julia, please do so right now on the CFK <laughs> YouTube page. It'll be like linked in the description. I don't know how YouTube works. <laughs> anyway, until next time. Bye! Bye.